welcome 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 back welcome back to your girl's channel y'all i want to say we are back with weekly weekend vlogs but i'm not sure so let's not say none of that yet um but this weekend is mother's day weekend so i'm kind of vlogging um it's friday about five something 520 it's about 520 i clocked out of work at 3 30. i was thinking about doing some ot today but ooh, focus i was thinking about doing some ot today but isabella has not been feeling well since yesterday morning she had a fever she didn't go to school yesterday she didn't go to school today so i'm on mummy super super mummy mode taking care of her so yeah i had a uh, laundry on the couch i just finished folding everything and i have a walmart delivery that just dropped you guys see all these bags behind me i'm going to do a little grocery haul because it's been a long time so i'm gonna do a little grocery haul and um gonna be putting the clothes away putting laundry away and um fix my bed because my sheets in the dry right now so yeah and then we took, we're cooking tacos tonight um yeah let me show you isabella she's sick don't mind my living room like i said folding laundry let me mute the tv <clears throat> so yeah that's my husband isabella my husband and i's clothes folded everything look at my baby she's sick she's not feeling well say hi bella hi. so yeah she um i need to keep tab on her medication she's been doing her little lol puzzle she had completed it but um yeah somebody messed it up so this is all the Walmart stuff and I have to clear out this kitchen area right here before I start cooking um, and that's it. What was I going to do? Oh yeah, I need to give Isabella some Tylenol because I believe I'm supposed to give it to her every four to six hours. My office, I already cleaned my office, y'all. I don't think I've ever shown y'all the new setup in my office. So let me show y'all real quick. Let me show y'all real quick. So, y'all remember down the hallway, this used to be Isabella's room. And this used to be my office after my brother moved out. So I don't think I ever showed y'all. Um, but this is the setup now with Isabella and my little sister. This is my little sister's bed and this is Isabella's bed. Of course, the room is a mess. Their bed is not made because it's Friday. We usually clean on Friday. My little sister got a job at McDonald's. But when she get home, all this got to be under control. Isabella have her LOL pillows, LOL bed sheets. You guys know it's LOL everything. That's their closet. You have a TV. Yeah, their window. So this used to be my office, if you guys remember the office setup video that was the room this is a way bigger room but since my sister came in she's staying with us for a little bit it made sense because their bed was crowded in the other room so it makes sense to give them this room and now this is my office so when you first walk in i got the l-shaped desk that's what guys remember i put together in that video it was brown this color but i did um i did um put contact paper on it and this is contact paper that you know have the texture of the wood and everything so that's the same contact paper that i have on this desk this is the ikea desk it's an old desk i still have my little makeup stuff on the side makeup stuff over here this used to be my makeup desk. It is still my makeup desk, but since my little sister is here for a minute and she's doing virtual school, I have her set up over here so I can keep an eye on her and make sure she's doing her schoolwork. This is her art. She drew these stuff. She's so talented. So 
my futon that my husband gave me for Christmas still here my car you know my husband and my best friend and my cousin surprised me for my birthday and this my birthday sign is still here my little lamp I still have everything this is my l-shaped desk work computer and I have my laptop over here so yeah I still do my Etsy stuff you guys I'm just out of stock right now I'm waiting to get um fully stocked again still have my tv yeah so this is my office now I done clean it up wipe down the desk and everything because I'm done for the day <clears throat> oh I needed to grab Isabella's Tylenol yeah that's her Tylenol hold on Some Tylenol. It's been six hours. You guys, if you know Isabella, you know she only do chewable stuff. So I'm going to use this um, to hold my camera. So I'm gonna show y'all what this is before. I put my camera on it. It's a 60 egg large white egg box. Um, always get those from Walmart. <clears throat> okay. This queen shirt, you guys, I've had since Bella was just a little baby, okay? She has the princess shirt. My husband has the king. I have the queen. Listen, you got to do that. If you ain't done it yet, you late. Everybody. Everybody done did that with their baby daddy once they had their first kid, the baby daddy, husband, whichever, whatever title y'all was at this time. Mine was my baby daddy. He's not my husband. All right, so let's get into this haul. So this is just some things like this is not a big grocery uh, restock. It's just little things that we need i do shop for groceries every couple weeks when i get paid i make sure i stack with everything that we'll need but i still run to the store weekly so red onions we don't like red yellow or white onions over here the only time we use those is if we're doing pico de gallo which i'm doing today but it's gonna have to be red onions in it because i forgot to grab a white onion Isabella and my little sister are obsessed over Ritz crackers, so I got them a box of Ritz. We got some. We got some hash brown patties for breakfast. Mustard. My little sister is obsessed over these Halo Top Pineapple Fruit Pops. This is also her juice. Cream grape. Yeah, cream grape. I got some green onions. I love to put that in my pico de gallo Brussels sprouts. Good for you. Cilantro. Y'all know it's taco night tonight. What else we got? Got Isabella some yogurt. She loves blueberries and mixed berries, but I couldn't find no mixed berries and blueberry. I could I can only find the strawberry and blueberry. So we know all the blueberries gonna be gone first. And that's okay. Is this raspberry? If this is raspberries, my husband's gonna throw a fit. Oh, that's the grape, um, grape tomatoes. Um, sometimes I don't like to dice tomatoes for pico de gallo, so I get these little grape tomatoes and I cut them in four, and I make my pico de gallo. Y'all will see later. Those are rip, rip. We got 
cream cheese for our bagels, regular plain cream cheese. We got a gallon of unsweet original almond milk from Almond Breeze. A bag of yellow potatoes because if I'm making potatoes um, hash, like you know, I don't know if you guys do that. Sometimes in the morning you dice your potatoes, you throw it. You let me tell you, you dice your potatoes, right? Yellow potatoes. You toss it in a bowl with some olive oil and all complete seasoning, garlic, salt, whatever seasoning of your preference, and you air fry. You air fry it for 20 minutes on 400 degrees. Mwah, so 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 good. So I always get me a bag of meal um, potatoes for because of that, or mashed potatoes. This is just a bella snack. Um, Kraft mac and cheese. I got three little cans of tomato paste. What else? Everything bagel for me and my little sister. But we still have a, a extra bag. But I always get a bag. A bag. I always want to be a bag ahead. Plain bagels for my husband. Like I said, this is enough groceries to last us for a couple of weeks. It's just my husband and my daughter and my little sister. Ketchup, mayo, ranch. I don't like ranch dressing, but my husband do. And whenever I make me a salad, he want a salad as well. So, yeah. What else we got? Hot dog buns. And this is Isabella's favorite, favorite breakfast at the time. But right now, this is her favorite breakfast. Isabella's favorite breakfast is cinnamon French toast sticks. So I got two boxes of those because she eat that every single morning unless she asks for something else. Blueberries. This is for my husband. Um, we got a bag of kale. I like sometimes. I make my breakfast bowl. Next time I make my breakfast bowl, I will definitely vlog and record that. Probably will be in a morning routine video for to show you guys what I do. Um. But yeah, I like to either have a side of sauteed kale or I add it as, you know, layers in my breakfast bowl. I got some chicken broth. Like We have some jalapenos for taco nights. We have a zucchini and a squash. Sometimes when I cook dinner, I like to have side of vegetables. Asparagus, all that for dinner. What I'm cooking throughout this next couple of weeks. Mild cheddar cheese. We don't like the taco blend. We like cheddar cheese. Sour cream. Like I said, it's taco night tonight. Taco Friday. Chobani Greek yogurt. That's the yogurt that my husband likes to eat. Got a little pack of hot dogs because it's a bit of grew a liking to um, hot dogs with mustard and ketchup. So that's why. It's just a little pet because it's just her. I also got her some more Tylenol. I got her some Tylenol. Why does, why does this look open? Okay, at least this is sealed. Right now, she currently have, I think, bubblegum flavor, but this is great. She doesn't have a lot left. And her doctor told me to, you know, that's what I need to give her. I also got this with a cinnamon fan because me, myself, Tylenol doesn't really work for my body. If I take a couple pills of acetaminophen, like my fever drop, especially when we had COVID, it helped us a lot. I had to get a big ass bottle. So I'm gonna try to give her this acetaminophen to see um, if it's going to do 
it's the same milligram it's 160 milligram they are each 160 milligram 160 milligrams so we'll see how that goes i got some shredded lettuce taco night i got my husband this for my husband he um he eat it like that sometimes for breakfast we got ground turkey for taco night and turkey sausage for breakfast we already have turkey bacon a lot of turkey bacon in the fridge and this is isabella's apple juice so yeah that's it i have a whole bunch of plastic bags on the floor i'm gonna take a picture real quick for thumbnail purposes but now i'm gonna put everything away and i'll see y'all when i'm putting uh, laundry away all right so while isabella's in her room let's make this whole thing clean now
I did clean the sofa. I did put all the all the laundry away, y'all. I just forgot to vlog the rest of the night. Okay. I did cook. Y'all saw me putting the tacos together. Anyways, today's the next day. It is Saturday, May 7. Yeah, today's the next day. Yes. You see Alicia outside? Yeah. Where? Let me see. Where is she? She coming back. I don't see Alicia outside. I don't see Alicia outside. See? But yeah, y'all, I did. It's the next day. Bella's feeling way better. And she's in here in my room messing things up. The bed was fixed when we woke up, but she's been jumping on it, laying on it, and everything. But it was fixed. I did fix all of that yesterday. Put my laundry away and everything. I took me a good shower, did my skincare. It was a good night last night. We enjoyed our tacos. It was very good. I had fixed me a little drinky drink last night. But now it's the next day. Your girl making breakfast, so. Just wanted to let y'all know what we doing, what we got going on. I'll catch y'all, I'll catch you later. I know I said I finished the vlog last weekend. Was it last weekend? I think it was. I know I said I ended the vlog last weekend, but this weekend, I'm not doing anything, but um, I'm going to my mom's tomorrow. So, cause she's um, setting up the new grill that we bought her. She asked, she requested for a specific grill. And that's the one we went and bought and dropped to her house for Mother's Day. So she want to open it up, break it out. So yeah, so that's what we're doing tomorrow. We're going to her house for a barbecue. So I just thought maybe I could vlog. I don't know yet. Um, today's Friday, May 13th. I didn't vlog all week because y'all, your, your girl has been working 10 to 12 hour shifts a day. And that's between... I've been clocking in uh, as early as 5 in the morning some days, clocking, um, work for a few hours, and around 7, I wake Isabella up, get her ready for school, drop her off to school, come back, get back to work, then around 9 o'clock, I make some breakfast, and you know, my husband's used to be off Wednesday, Thursdays, but now his days off change. He's off Friday, Saturdays now. So Wednesday, Thursdays, where I usually would have a break about cooking his lunch. I don't have that anymore. So yeah, so around 10 o'clock I make breakfast and around 10, no, around nine I make breakfast. Around 10, 11, I prepare his lunch, which usually is just dinner for us. I cook dinner early, but yeah. And then back to work and then I'll, again, I'll take a break from work around four to leave and go pick up Isabella from school and I'll work till like 6.30 or um, 6.30, one time I work till nine. <sighs> it's crazy. We only have 10 hours mandatory overtime per week. But, someone's at my door. I think it's my package. Let's see.
dedicated. I know what. I ordered a couple of things, but I don't think it's anything yet because I ordered Fashion Nova a couple of days ago and I ordered the Marc Jacob tote a few days ago, probably four days ago. So let's see what this is because I'm still sitting at my desk, y'all. I'm working till 4.30 today. It's 4.20. So I'm wrapping things up with work and I was like, hey, let me start vlogging. And talking to y'all. Uh, oh, this. This stuff. That's what it is. I was about to say what the heck. What was I saying? I'm watching Natasha's, Natasha on um, YouTube right now. I don't know if you guys know her. Love her guess her don't be paying attention to what's on my work computer but yeah what was i saying so yeah your girl that yeah so yeah i only have 10 hours mandatory time uh mandatory overtime but your girl been getting as many ot as i can for now while it's available and i've been treating myself you know i got me a couple few things um your girl got her a little toy birch card case next i want to get me the little ysl card case i saw it it was cute um i, I like the ysl i took a trip to sephora y'all i got me some new makeup i got the fancy skin like i can't believe i didn't i really haven't been vlogging y'all it's not i've been doing stuff i just haven't vlogged it let me see what is let me see if I can show y'all what I bought, um, got from Sephora before I open this package so we can figure out what's inside. Let's see. I'm sitting at my white desk right now. My sister has been sitting here for virtual school. And look, she got stuff. I can't wait for her ass to come home. But uh, let's see. Since we haven't spoke. Since it's been a minute since we, we talked. I got some El Maquillage. I think it was $80. And y'all, I'm going to explain to you guys how I ended up with two foundations, two concealers for the price of one. So, I went on El Maquillage and I did the whole test. I did it for this foundation, which is, I woke up like this. It's a, a matte foundation come in a glass bottle i forgot what shade they sent me i think this oh they sent me shade 235 and then i had the fuck i'm flawless um concealer they sent it to me in a shade 15 okay so my cousin marcia she have a youtube channel as well y'all talks with marcia but she mostly be on tiktok I'm gonna post her. I'm gonna link her TikTok. I'm gonna post a TikTok in the description box. But okay, so my cousin Marsha, right? We did it around. She did it like I. We talked about doing it, then I forgot. And when she did it, she was like, "Oh, I just did it." I was like, "Oh, let me go do it." So we did it around the same time. Our packages. We got our packages. Um, I think we did it. We did it like the same day. So we got our packages like a day apart, or if not the same day. So. Tell me how her foundation matched me and my foundation matched her. But she didn't like hers. This is this was hers. She had the after party. They sent her the after party shade 230. And they sent me, woke up like this shade 235. So the after party comes like this in a tube bottle. Because that's what she wants. Because, you know, for traveling, she's like, it's easier to take this when she's traveling instead of the instead of the glass bottle i'm trying to show you the glass bottle without opening the box because it, it has a cool little opening too the glass bottle see with you know so we we switched and we use it for that weekend because that's what matched us then we went on the website and we we're like okay it wasn't my talk i said mine was too dark she said hers was too light and girl usually we thought they was gonna make us return it but they told us we could keep it and they sent us the right shade 
So since they sent, so they told us we could keep it, she ended up keeping the glass bottle that they sent me that matched her and I kept the two bottle that they sent her that matched me. And then now Il Maquillage resent me the glass bottle in my right shade and they also sent me a foundation a little bit lighter. So the one they previously sent me was a 15. The one, the new one they sent me is a 14.5, which they, the 15, I feel like if I'm doing a light, a no makeup makeup look I could use, it's close, it's very close to my skin tone. But the 14.5 is just a little bit lighter, which is not bad. Like, I liked it when I used it. It makes my under eye a little bit brighter and I enjoyed it. So yeah, so we each ended up, but her, she didn't do, she did foundation and primer. I did foundation and concealer. So I ended up with two concealer, two foundation. I think she ended up with two foundation, one primer. Cause I don't think she said anything about her primer, but I ended up with two too. So yeah, so yes girl. So I have the Il Maquillage After Party foundation in the shade 230. And then I have Il Maquillage Woke Up Like This in the shade 230 as well. So I got two type of foundation bouquet boo. I'm good. And you know, your girl don't even go out like that. And I have two concealers. So you see how then you can, this one is lighter, but it's not. It it's different, but it looks good when I do my makeup and stuff. So yeah, let me see. Okay, so when I went to Sephora, the Sephora bag still at the bottom. I got the Fenty Beauty Rihanna lip gloss and Fenty Glow. Um Fenty Glow Zero Two. I got that. It's in my purse. I wanna get up and go get my purse. It's in my purse. I've been keeping it in my purse. It's it's been my go-to. It's been my go-to lip. This is the box that the Il Maquillage Concealer came in. What else I got? I got a mini size of the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. Like I said, I don't go out like that, so I don't wear makeup. I went to when I went to dinner um, last Sunday for Mother's Day with my cousin and my best friend Shay. I didn't even wear any makeup, so yeah. I went back to Sephora again with my best friend Shay. I went by myself and then I went back with her and my cousin. So yeah, we I got this. I definitely want to get the big bottle. So yeah. Your girl with all this OT I'm doing, this is the time to treat myself right now. Not that I can with my regular check, but we gotta save, boo. I got these two spray bottles. From, did I get this one from Sephora or Ulta? I, yeah, I got this one from Sephora. Revolution Matte Fix. I got it. It's a big bottle. Look at my hand. Look how it fit in my hand. And I also got the mini of the Charlotte Tilbury um, setting spray. Love this setting spray. This is another one that I want to get a regular size of. Like next Sephora trip, I need a, the Hydro Grip in a full size and I need this spray in a full size. It's not the mini is not that small, and then again, I don't wear makeup often, so this will probably last me a long time. But I definitely want to get the full size because I want to make it a permanent thing in my makeup collection. Okay, so Charlotte Tilbury spray set spray with the Revolution Matte Fix. I use both of them when I'm putting my makeup on. I use both. So, I, and then I showed you guys the Fenty Skin Butter butter Drop that I got. Love it. I want, I think these are the only things that I got. Oh, I got my husband a perfume as well for Father's Day. But I'm not going to show y'all. My husband don't watch my YouTube. <laughs> he doesn't. He used to when he was on the road but now he doesn't so i can definitely show y'all it's not like he gonna see it you know what never mind i don't he never told me he watched my videos but so but i don't it would be my luck that i would show y'all you know when he watches my video but i'm gonna show y'all what i got what he gave me for mother's day i'm gonna show y'all in a few before it's in my room. I don't want to get up now. So, I mean, I have one minute left from work. I'm about to wrap things up. 
I just need to close all my applications and um, clock out for the day and uh, make sure my hours is looking right for this week. So yeah, I did all my OT uh, from Monday to Friday. We have Saturday and Sunday available for OTs as well, but since my husband's been off on Friday, Saturdays, I like to like get my OT out of the way. Like today, I, I clocked in at five and I'm clocking at 4.30. I could push it to 5.30, but nah, I'm, I wanna, um, I'm cooking, I'm cooking fish tonight, so I know I'm gonna be tired. I don't wanna be too tired. I wanna be able to like, you know, take a shower and relax in bed with him today and then tomorrow i'm gonna have the whole day with him i'm not working i'm not doing ot on saturdays no more now that he's off on saturdays so yeah let me click out and then we're gonna open this package i don't i got a new perfume from ulta when I have, since I stopped vlogging. I think I got a couple. I think I got a few that I didn't show y'all. So, <laughs> yeah. So, we'll see. I'm gonna show y'all all the ones that I have and we'll see which one. Uh, I skipped lunch today. So them hours looking right, right. Yep, it's a Marc Jacob. It's the Marc Jacobs. Let me show y'all. It's the Marc Jacobs. So Let me put the camera like this. I'm trying to turn around to see if y'all can. Oh, let me do, yeah, let me do that. I got it in black and I got the mini, the canvas. Did not want to pay over $300 for the leather she's cute my new everyday bag she's real cute let me take a little a little insta story Alright y'all, I did my little Instagram me pull Instagram me um I did a boomerang. I know y'all done y'all see y'all know designers. This not no designer. This is just a little Mark Jacob child. So the mini traveler Mark Jacob taught told why is it tot? What the? I'm not thinking about potato tots. Oh my god. The mini traveler Mark Jacob Toad retails for $175. Shipping and handling was $0. It was free shipping. And um, taxes was like $11.38. So I ended up paying $186.38. It came with a return label and everything if anything is wrong with it. This is the type of companies I need to purchase from. The one that send you a return label with your purchase. Right? This is so cute. You already know how I roll. I'm about to fix my new bag. <laughs> and um, the bag I've been using, I've been using my Aldo Greenwald Greenwald bag. 
My Aldo Green Wall, I think I got it for like $60. Aw. Now I feel like I want to film y'all on what's in the bag. What's in my bag? What is this? information about the bag what they recommend like oh I need to look at that because what about when it gets dirty and stuff y'all you guys it's like look at this little details on the inside I'm about to show y'all it says Mark Jacob Mark Jacobs Mark Jacobs going down I don't know if y'all can see it on the inside here you see it says Mark Jacob, Mark Jacob. On all four, you can see it over there. On all four corners. All the way down the inside. I like the inside. I feel like if my snacks spill in here, I can easily clean it up. Yeah, I just wish it had a little inside bag. The zipper goes all the way out. But I like the fact that they took it in. That's, I'm going to keep it tucked in like that. I love tote bags with zippers. Uh, keep everything in. I wish it had a little inside. Inside bag. But it's cute. You know, we got toddlers. So we don't carry a whole bunch of stuff. I have a whole five-year-old now. No need to carry diapers and wipes no more. And when I do have a new baby, I'll just get the bigger size of this. You know? You know. I, w um, I wanted to get, I think I'm going to get a, a Mark Jacob. What you call these? Ugh, I forgot. Strap. They have the Mar I think the Mar Jacob strap is like eighty dollars, and it says Mar Jacob, Mar Jacob, Mar Jacob all over it. I might get me a strap. So, you, this says Mar Jacob on it too. So it's so tiny, you might not even see it. Can y'all see it? If the camera is zooming in on my nose, y'all, I know my nose crusty. I just don't want to go get them yet. I'm waiting to my best friend's bridal shower to be honest. Cute. So I'm definitely going to wear cross body a lot. So that's it for the unboxing. That was the unboxing, y'all. Um, I don't want to show y'all what I'm putting in my bag because I want to do it what's in my bag. This is my Aldo green walls. I got it in black. I love that purse. Not going to lie. I've been getting a lot of use. It's been getting a lot of use, but I think <laughs> I think the tote but just retired her. Because I'm liking the tote. Next in the tote, I definitely want to get get the red leather one. This is the fancy gold gloss I was telling y'all. I was telling y'all about. Uh, I don't know if y'all saw the camera just. Stop. I don't know if y'all heard me or not, but I said I fucked out. I showed y'all my new, I unboxed my new purse with y'all. So now let's head over to my closet so I can show y'all my Mother's Day gift. 
yeah so this is mark jacobs daisy love my mom bought that for me for christmas i went to ulta sometime between january and february and then i got me this versace bright crystal smells really good like i said all one ounce size and then i went to ulta some other times i don't remember and then i got me this gucci bloom and yeah this was a this is a sample that i have of the mark jacob daisy yeah so yeah and this one is la vie belle oh my bad this one is la vie belle Lancome. literally like got so little left and that's my favorite one out of all of them so yeah oh yeah now we in my closet and let me show y'all what i got here go bella hi i, I hurt my mouth you hurt your mouth yeah. let mama see oh no you okay mm -hmm. okay uh, this was this is my husband's I give this to him for what was it Valentine's Day? We have matching ones. He gave me mine for Christmas, and um, this is my Mother's Day gift. I've been talking about starting to get more serious. I have I have a couple of Snickers. I have a couple of Snickers. I have a few. One, two. I have a I have a few, but I feel like this is stepping me into the sneaker world for real for real i've been talking about getting a not i'm not gonna stop at one because now that i've seen the shoe face to face my husband and i were like damn i think both of us we're turning into sneaker heads my husband hasn't been very concerned about tennis shoes but every single one i have he gonna have so he ain't got no choice now This color is so pretty to me. Oh. Bella, move, please. Look at this color, y'all. I feel like the camera's not doing it justice. my mother's day gift should i wear them tomorrow love them now i need to we have a shoe plug now i need to reach out to the shoe plug and ask him to make it happen i need the matching pair for my husband how did i get it out <laughs> how was it was it like this yeah that's how it was right yeah i want to say that's how it was but i love this shoe love it so yeah that's my mother's day gift Now I feel like y'all all updated. Ooh, let me get up. <sighs> oh, let me lay down. Y'all grow tired. I feel like y'all all updated now. You guys, I was doing so good with my skincare. I was on a roll. I started taking vitamins. Um, the vitamins I'm taking, I'm taking a, a fertility supplement, um, a natural supp fertility supplement, and I'm taking D3, B12, um, fish oil, and um, I think that's it. I was doing so good, you guys, and when I got sick last week, I really fell off my skincare. I fell off 
my vitamins. I started taking my vitamins again the past couple of days. Um, but yeah, um, I don't know. I don't think I'm going to vlog tomorrow because it's family day and I want to enjoy that. So I'm going to end the vlog right here from last weekend and today. I feel like I caught you guys up on everything that I got since since I've been ghost on YouTube. So yeah, I'll see y'all in the next vlog. Probably going to be our beach day. So please like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, thank you so much for stopping by.